on this rant, these damn kids, and getting old. So, kids complained because they had to have a gaming PC just to play VR and cords and Wi-Fi and blah, 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 and high-speed internet. So, they gave us standalone VR. Well, then they complained that the games were too expensive for... You know, there's no demos and no way to try it for free, blah, blah, blah. So we bootlegged all the games for you. Well, then you guys complain that you you had to search for them on the internet. Oh, God, I got to Google for free games and then install them sideload into your MetaQuest, blah, blah, blah. So we made a standalone sideloader to propagate the stolen games and put them on your MetaQuest all in one go. Then you complain that it's too hard to figure out. I can't. I don't know how to... What does reboot mean? So, I then, without a help video, figured out how it all worked and made a help video for free. Teaching you how to get the games to install on your headset for free. And plenty of comments. Thanks, thanks, thanks. Awesome, you saved me 300 bucks, whatever. But... 10 to 1. For every good comment, I have 10 comments that are asking the same questions over and over and over. Can I get banned for this? First of all, if you could get banned for it, don't you think every 9-year-old with his mommy's credit card and a MetaQuest 3 and a high-speed data connection would be in the comments complaining that he got banned? Even if only one, he would be blowing up my comments, threatening to sue me, blah, blah, blah. Two... Reboot means reboot the headset. Turn it off, turn it back on. Reboot the computer means turn it off, turn it back on. Hit the power button, hit restart. Fuck. If that's really holding you up, bootlegging games onto your headset is not for you. Two. Three. Whatever. C. Um, do online games work? Or, you know, does it have this game? Or does this do this? Or does that do that? Instead of reading the comments and seeing that the, that's already been asked like a million fucking times, and I've already answered it a million fucking times nicely, and then I start just getting irritated and I just stop answering or I just delete the question because it's like, fuck, man, if you're not going to read all these comments, why are you going to read the one that I replied? You know what I mean? So I reply to him regardless. I keep replying to him. I keep replying to him. But the moral of the story is, is like, for example, is the question is, does it have Beat Saber? Fucking open the fucking app and type in Beat Saber, you fucking lazy fuck. Why do you got to ask me in the comments when you can just do it? Do online games work? I don't know. Install one of the online games and try it. Does it work on this headset? I don't know. I don't own them all. Fucking, oh my God. I realize now that you people are the worst of the worst of the worst. You're too lazy to Google stuff. You're too cheap to pay for stuff. And then you expect everything to be spoon-fed to you. And when it doesn't work, even though nine-year-old kids figure it out, just watch the video one time and nine-year-old kids got it. I did it without a video. And then made a video. Read the fucking comments. Jesus Christ.